welcome watchers welcome welcome to kingdoms reborn yes welcome to the tips series um so let's get in there this is where we finished last time in episode two as you can see the save games are still there now so we won't have any issue with that so this is doodlebug gaming town it isn't going to be actually we're going to rename it not sure what to call it i might call it um let's call it something Welby. We're gonna call it Welby. I don't know why, but that's what it's gonna be called now. Um so let's have a look where we are. We've got nearly three thousand food, so we're actually doing quite well with food, actually. Um stone isn't too well. We're we we're, we're good with the old medicine. Um so we just keep progressing. We do no no we we've got twenty adults and we've got eight children so this is where we are we're just actually going to let me just speed this up a little bit um we're actually going to grab some more stone but i want to try and get the road so i can try and take some of this stuff i want to see if we can do this um so i'm hoping we can so they've got they're 29 what are we on oh 28 they're actually beating me <clears throat> I don't get this is this is on hard so um I expect them to beat me to be honest. Um right so are we uh how much stone we got? We haven't got loads of stone yet have we? Right, let's see what this is. Uh clay pit coal mine, we do need to get a clay pit, so let's actually just buy that while it's there. Doesn't like being near housey, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this somewhere. I'm going to put that over here because houses don't like it, but it's good for us. Um, what's that? What's that building there? That's a fruit gatherer as well. Okay, so we don't need to fruit gather. It's early winter, so we are actually going into the actual snowy season now, unfortunately. Um, so make sure you're wearing your coats. Right, we don't need any houses yet, but we will do eventually. Um, I'm going to start upgrading them. And obviously you click on these houses, what, what does actually help to upgrade them is insulation. It costs 20 stone, but it is worth it. It will help them through the winter. Right, we've run out of stone there, so I'm going to have to wait until they actually produce some. Um, manage stone. What we're going to do is we're going to disallow all. And what we're only going to allow... Oh, no. We're only going to allow stone. So let's actually see if we can find stone. That's it. Right, so that area there is only for stone. We'll see if that actually works. A uh, fruit gatherer will write charcoal burner. We've got quite a bit on that. Um, could do with another fishing thing. Right, so let's have a look and see what other things we can get here. Recall, reroll costs half as much. Ideation, that's plus one card each reroll. Claiming ball for us cost half as much. I'm going to go with that one. Um, once we've got this one, then we can start unlocking the other bits as well. Um, we should be alright to get through the winter. We've got quite a bit of um, food and accessories there. Charcoal, they're still producing that, so that's good. We need some labourers, so obviously if you want to manually do this. We, are, we have actually got seven labourers, but I'm going to change that a little bit. I would like some eight. Eight labourers so they can start collecting resources and stuff while the winter is. We won't be actually building anything in the week, winter, so they might as well make something useful themselves. Fishing odd, sell food. No, we will work with the, um, what we've got at the moment. We need to pick up some of this wood for definite. Um, what I want to do actually is make a stockpile just for 
clay so disallow it and that is just clay that's all it's allowed on there this can be just for wood ah he's just put stone ah oh, man just about make that all wood oh forget about that gonna do another f farm I don't think it was very good here was it yeah it's not that great fertile uh, employing allowing managing job priorities yeah, we could build that we do need that oh hang on we've got that now so let's kill at half capacity to get some more pork um, right employment let's just put that over here and the statics building can go there as well. Got eight labourers, we're on 30 now. We'll see on next door. Let's just have a look and see what he's actually on. 31. I'm coming for you, mate. I am coming. get any better on the efficiency there oh 102 98 very close with each other here yeah? oh what I was saving on I forgot to turn that off actually so I'll just have to uh turn that off in a minute right so to top's tip is basically the more land that you try and buy the more money so you get income so you get more income for the more land you buy um, so this is obviously what we earn here this bit here if I bought this it would be 104 through but it gives me another 7.8 coins so it, it does add up this bit here is a hundred food so the more land you can try and get the food is is the game so just keep banging out the food and the more you can get the more uh, money you can actually make off it don't think we're actually near any coal are we die farming oh I didn't know that there's actually a computer player down the bottom here What's he doing then? He's got houses. He's got a forest star. He's got some hunting stuff going on. So he's at the bottom. So we're quite we are we are very close here then. All of us are stuck on this island here. That's Andy. He's got the more chance of it, he's got he's near the coal and the iron deposits. I'm not actually near iron deposits. I'm next to loads of this dye farming over here. There's some over there. I thought there'd have been some here, but so actually we could try and get a road up to him and a road down to him. That would be interesting. 150 food. Oh, I'm sure I've got enough. See now I'm, pl I'm making plus 85 and I've, I've still got loads and loads of um, stuff that I need so they're cutting a plant what we could do is upgrade upgrade forest town 30% production when you own three foresters 30% efficiency we'll get two people in there right we've got the farming going on so that's going to carry on so that's good what I might do is see if we can actually get another pig. There it is. And that will sit in there quite nicely there. Just get rid of all of that. Right, what else we've got here? Sell food. No, we don't do that. Hunt. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll take one of them just in case I need one. We ain't got anything down this part of the world, so I 
what we on 31 and 36 let's just build another house what's that pill anyway there is that quite a nice good appeal oh 100 percent that's quite good and it's only that side I think that is good for the farming side of it yeah it actually gets worse as it goes down so we might be able to do some little bit of farming over this side of the world I did, I did want to carry it on but oh well I can, I can carry on don't say I can't just won't produce fertile um, is that going to cause much of an issue oh, I'm sure it won't Obviously when we progress we'll be able to have more, um, we're going to have some warehouses and stuff so that will be uh, much better. Alright, so that's collecting the food, we're doing well with the food, we're getting stone gradually so stone is happening uh, wood was still quite low on wood to be honest what I might need is to put a forester down here there it is just to keep a forest so we, we need to keep a forest going somewhere so what I might suggest is actually put the forester there and then put the storage next to it oh no I won't need it will it won't need it it's just cutting and planting yeah that'll be right so we're going to get some pork as well so that, that pork will be there we've got loads of oranges 1209 oranges at the moment we are orange fantastic Right, let's come down. How much is that over there? Gives me another five coin, but I'm doing all right with the coin at the moment. What's old half doing? I was hoping he might be going a bit um, short, but he isn't. Uh, wheat? Uh, yeah, let's let's do some wheat. So we've got the pig area. I may be tempted going forward to put a bit more um, in actually I'm going to put two of them out get some more oranges in while we're thinking about it upgrade that upgrade more workers don't need that at the moment uh, 30, 36, got 51 storage out of 56, so, um, but yeah, the, the, the tip basically, guys, is obviously build your food up at the beginning, make sure you have loads and loads of food, just do loads of food, just concentrate on your food, don't worry about, and obviously houses, but just build enough houses that you need for the, your actual villagers, because what you need is a lot of food, once you get a lot of food, you can buy more land, you know, um, and the more land you get, the more money you get from the income of it. Um, so, yeah, it's quite important that. Um, buy wood with half of your treasury. Oh, potter. Do need a potter because I've got a clay, but I've got no pottery. So, let's see if we can put that in there. Yes, we can. Beautiful. 
um, that's just going to be clay so that's good and then the other side of that I'm going to have another storage area that is just going to be pots if I can jewelry pottery there you go so that would just be pottery um, what I'd see they could be used f for wood as well um, the chopping trees down actually right next to it can be for the trees that can be for whatever they want to put it as There's loads and loads of materials, look, just dotted about everywhere, we just haven't got enough. Labourers. I haven't got any bloody builders either. Let's have at least two builders. We'll cut down on that. need a thousand for the next one we're getting an investment as well so that will help with the money coming in as well so we've got we're getting some builders going as well now so that will help eventually we've got some more food coming in um all right for food at the moment don't need anything there for the moment, right, this is going to have to be sorted eventually, we're still getting some porco, or game meat, 19 cabbage, have I got room to, yes, oh no I haven't, damn, I thought I had room then, got room here right, eh? Actually, we could do that all the way along there. Alright, that is got. So, we need storage here for this one. Taking it all up there. Oranges, got loads of oranges. What's he doing? He's on 31. And so has he got loads of oranges as well. My god, look at the amount of oranges he's got. I want a bit of that. It will be mine eventually. I always end up spacing stuff out like massively apart. I don't know why I do that. I always do that. Mm, no, we don't need anything at the moment. We've got 36, we've got 29, 54, 56 going of storage. Let's fast that up a little bit. wish to buy any goods you might have mm, I don't want to sell anything at the moment I don't really need to and food doesn't sell that good anyway and to be honest I don't really want to get rid of food I'd rather just keep hold of that just in case I do need it eventually buy wood now we're doing well with wood again um, Forester could just get one of them just in case Keep that down there. Uh, 
Right, it's a set priority. Uh, uh, charcoal has to come up a bit further than that. The hunting lodge can go down a little bit. Clay pit is fine. Fruit gatherer. Right, okay. Right, that looks alright at the moment. We're not doing too bad. Uh, we're making the money. Look at the oranges that he's got. I so damn want his area. We need more people. Oh, bollocks. I was meant to go for that immigration and I missed it. 50 coin. There it is. Oh, furniture workshop. Alright, immigration. Furniture workshop that I think, yeah, they don't like that. So we're going to build this as our little industrial area over it. And what it can do, it can have... I wish you could actually make these a bit longer. Instead of just doing them in little sections. Quite annoying that is. Right, this can be a storage area. So this could be our warehouse, this could be our sort of industrial area if you like. And then this, oh, oh no, it's, it's still being built. It's still tank forever. Industrial area, then we can have our storage area here. Alright, so that is done, so... Fruit gather hopefully we'll start putting it here. Yep, excellent. Put some coal there as well. Not sure why he's put coal there, but maybe where the actual coal is. It's all full up around here. That's a possibility. If that is the case, then we can actually put more storage here. Show tech tree, so we need one more. I'm going to go with the spy card, I think. Right, that can be that. That there can be coal. Then that way, it is right next to them they don't have to try and run around trying to find area we're doing brilliant medical herbs we've got medicine dried grass that could be used for animal feed we do need some more of that eventually no yeah it's not going too bad I'm going to leave it there guys it's been a pleasure as always um if you like the video then please give it a like and please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already um, and go back and have a look at the other series um, this is the series that we're just going to carry on with now um, so obviously the tip here is obviously start with loads of food just food 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 once you build a house just build enough that you need or maybe one extra but the more food you have that means you can get more land that means provides you more income um, it's a bit of a catch-22 really but um, yeah that is that is the more vital part well thanks for joining me guys this has been Doodlebug and this has been another Kingdoms Reborn you know it's the only channel to watch Kingdoms Reborn it's Doodlebug Gaming until next time I'll see you later goodbye stay safe be happy